we're back, brothers and sisters. Uh, so here's my next question. When you reflect on your walk with the Honorable Minister Louis Farrakhan, are there any interactions of his that you have personally experienced or witnessed that show in a very profound way his love, character, humility, or any quality that he possesses that comes to mind? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The first thought is, I would say to all that's listening, the one thing that the minister loves to see is us expressing the beauty of God in ourselves. He's not envious of any of us. And he does not want us to let that opportunity uh, go, to, go to the side. One day in the salon restaurant, he said to me, I said to him, brother minister, I sound like a brother minister. He said, here's my great preacher. I said, no, sir, brother minister, you're the great preacher. He said, stop right there. He wouldn't let me say that. He said, God has deposited him, himself in each and every one of us. And another time he was whooping me. Well, he was whooping me at the table. Uh, we were in, I think, St. Louis. And I mean, it was a bunch of folk there. And I'm trying to eat and he's whooping on me. And he came to the point where he said, brother, uh, you are a great minister. I want you to let your light shine. Now, you know, when he said you are a great minister, a great preacher, you know, me, brother, will they like you? Like, minister, you, you really think that I, you know, I can do this? And I want you to let your light shine. He's always trying to show us the beauty of God in ourselves. And he wants us to express that. And not just to see the God in him, but in each and every one of us. And he works hard to get us to see that. And it's honored when he see us expressing that. Um, so those are the things that I would say, uh, if, uh, uh, I, 